You've seen Cuban-born actress Marlene Forte in such films as Real Women Have Curves and as the Transport Chief in Star Trek and on TV in Tyler Perry's House of Pain and NBC's Crossing Jordan. Well, she just landed the role of Carmen on TNT's remake of the TV series Dallas, one of the biggest hits on primetime in the 80s. Now, Marlon is not only an award-winning actress, she is also producer, co-director of the Angels Theater Company, a mother, wife, and so many other things. So <laughs> welcome, Marlene. Hi, welcome, Marlene. Marlene. Very busy. So yeah, yeah. And just to clarify, because I used to do theater at the Company of Angels, it's the Company of Angels. It's but, the Company yeah. of Angels, yes. Um, how Great. old were you when you left Cuba, and did your dream of acting start there? Well, probably, although I don't remember because I was only nine months old oh. when I left. Oh. I was a very tiny little girl, um, and um, my mom, we came straight to New York. My, my dad wanted to be an American, and he left Cuba with no idea of coming back. So, so he didn't, we never landed in Miami. You oh, no, you did it. It. Never. <laughs> I, all my family is there. I go to visit a lot, mm -hmm. but I never landed so in Miami. So Juana goes to New York, okay. New York, and then you get to Hollywood. And you come all the way to Hollywood, you've done some amazing Made oh, some amazing you, work. Thank yeah. you. Why don't we take a look at yes, some okay. of her work right now? Look, I have no idea how many of these people have gone missing over the years, but one thing is clear. I'm the only one who seems to give a damn. Just so you know, I'm planning on leaving him. If you want to stick around. How fucked up would that be? Yeah? Mm, very nasty. <laughs> Ten years in the school system. No one ever say boo about my kid. All of a sudden, there's disabilities. I was going to say the same to you. But you were gone before breakfast. Uh, I'm an early riser. I'll say. Oh. It's not yours! It's not yours to take! What do you think you're doing out there? That's Deliman. How can you say that? Deliman was only 10 days old the last time you saw her. You were sleeping with him. You have no you right. You basically let the killer in. Let the killer put a bullet in your husband's head. Alberto was weak. He got what he deserved. I heard you track down that deadbeat dad of yours and decked him. I dropped him with one punch. That's not something I'm proud of. I just, you know. <laughs> Good for you. You still wet the bed? <laughs> That's perverted. Why do you want to take pictures of girls you don't know instead of taking pictures of women? Why don't you try talking to one? Beam us out of here! Stand by, locking on your signal. I can't lock on. Don't move, don't move! Here! Go! I'm trying, Beam I can't lock on your signal, you're moving too fast. My husband owns the largest banana importing exporting business in the world. If you're eating a great banana, it's probably his. That's good. Amazing. Amazing. Great, fantastic. Good Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Now, Thank you it. have just been cast, you were recently cast. I was. In the pilot for a remake of one of the most iconic television series ever on TV, Dallas. That's right. Tell I us about it. your role and how did you get cast? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 It's her talent that got her cast. Uh, you know, I think they saw everybody in Hollywood, and then they finally, my my <laughs> lovely manager finally got me an audition. Um, oh, wow. Um, I, you know, I have been doing this for a very long time, yes. and. Um, and it's funny because I've been playing older than I always have, and for, they didn't want to see me for this. I'm playing Jordana uh, Brewster's mom, mm -hmm. um, but she's and, not Latina. Is she Latina? Um, well, I, she's Brazilian, right? And she's, I, you know, she's a mutt. Mm. Um, she's beautiful. <laughs> she's not 100 percent Latina like me. Uh -huh. but, yeah, but that's interesting. <laughs> so, so they finally got you the audition. So they got me the audition, and I went in, and you know what? It, it was, um, and I, I, I keep hearing this. I've been doing this over 20 years, and they say when the moment actually hits, it's going to be very easy uh -huh. and it was kind of effortless. Really? Um, the writing was fantastic. Um, um, another Cuban, fellow Cuban, Cubana, wrote it. Um, Who's that? Uh, Cynthia Cidre. Uh, C C wow. yes. And she's in Mambo Kings and King Kane King. and King. I mean, she's so fabulous. we're gonna have a much stronger Latino presence in this version of Dallas than in the original. It's I, I hope so. Dallas. No? It's Dallas. It's going to be Dallas. Right. Um, I hope so. I think because it's you know it's not a remake. It is the continuation. Oh, it's a continuation. And that's exactly oh. what my question is gonna be. So it's actually called people? the Passing of the Guards. Okay, so. 
And for people that maybe didn't see Dallas in the 80s, they can catch up right away. Completely. We have um, uh, some of the cast, of the original cast. Yes. Uh, Larry Hagman. Yes, Larry Hagman is back. So they play the, they play the they same play roles. They play JR, Bobby wow. Hewitt. And same. this is how many years later now? It's their children, and their children now are in their late 20s. Oh my God. So it's Bobby's uh, son and JR's son who are both madly in love with my beautiful daughter. <laughs> and, um, and you know, oh. it has all the wonderful things that, that Dallas had, which is, you know, sex and intrigue <laughs> and cheating and lying. I all the time. Oh. And you know what? They were big with fashion back then, too. Oh, wow. They were like the, you know, the gossip the girls. Show. Oh, God. Yeah. Yeah. It, was, it was glamour. And it was glamour yeah. in it Texas. Was, yeah. It was right. a, a telenovela. At <laughs> night. It was at a night. Telenovela. Novela, prime, before they, before America even knew what a telenovela right. was, they That's were right. doing before a telenovela in prime time. Part and of the vernacular in English. Put women catfighting on the map, right? Yeah. What about the <laughs> young girl? Is she in it too? What's her name? The young Yeah, she is. She's in it. Who? Uh, Heather Locklear? No, no, no. no. The, the young blonde Linda girl. Gray. It's no, no, Linda no. Gray. That's not the young blonde no. girl. I work with Linda I know, Gray. but it's Linda Gray. So it's Bobby Hewing. Back. It's uh I mean um Patrick Duffy, uh Larry Hagman and oh god, the lady who's playing um now, is Patrick your daughter Douglas. a you? No. no, she is not. Uh, we come from Mexico uh, oh. when she's about nine. Mm -hmm. So um, she grows up with the kids, and I am not the maid. I am the cook. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. that there. Right. I know who I'm uh, a chef. I'm chef. the chef head chef. You are a chef. Awesome. And I also kind of, you know, I run the... Listen, you know, the beauty about this role is, you know, and, and I, make a, I make a funny funny joke sometimes. If you look at my work, sometimes it's 20 minutes of weepy mommy over uh -huh. something right. or another. The and now the Mario beauty father. of getting older <laughs> is that I have the, uh, the, the luxury to say what I, what's on my mind. Yes. She has a great sense of humor. It was written by a woman, a Latina woman. That's so fabulous. It really great. has that kind of, you know, I loved it. And I got to tell you, I fought Paolo a little bit on it. I was like, you want me to be the cook on Dallas? <laughs> I know. <laughs> no, but it's going to be fabulous. And I just remembered the name of the uh, the girl, Charlene Tilden. That was her name. Yeah, and I don't yes. know if she... I think she's on there. I think is I, she? I Tilden think so. or Tilson? Yeah, I don't know who you're talking about. There was a lot about. of people that I didn't get to see at but the But this is so exciting. I think so, we could go on forever yeah, yes. talking about this. I know. But I want to get to the passion. You have a passion for theater. I do. And you started your passion in New York with the Labyrinth Theater, I which did. is a famous... Theater company there. Labyrinth Theater you're... Company taught me everything I know about acting. Mm -hmm. It was uh, it started as the Latinos Actors Base by Gary wow. Perez and and Paul Calderon and John Ortiz, and um, it it I just I didn't have the luxury. I was a single mom early, and I didn't have the luxury to act, learn acting. So your training has been on the stage. And now it's been your school. Now, yeah. now you're the co-director of Company, company of, Angels. of Angels. Tell Our us about artistic director of Company of Angels. It's, it's oldest, one of the oldest uh, yes. uh, theater company in Los Angeles, and I do want to put out there that it is now run by two Latinos. Yeah, uh, we're and taking over the world. We are taking over slowly <laughs> but surely, and we live on Fifth and Spring, which is right across the street from LATC, Absolutely. which is Alexandria. Alexandria. in Los Angeles. Yes. In Los Angeles. So now it's the Latino Theater District. That's right. That's right. <laughs> we're taking over Fifth and Spring. Yes. And, um, yes. Now you yes. can also, you know have more presence in other projects too, yeah. right? Yeah. Yes, you know, it's like that little ant that is pushing the boulder right. over the hill. You well, know. you have well, to Marlene. come back to us when you're yes. back when you're shot the Dallas, the This pilot. show, that this boulder. show is one of those things, <laughs> one of those, you know, you guys are one of the ants oh, pushing over you. that boulder. Thank you, you so we need much. More of we'll this. have you back when you come back from shooting the pilot. Right. Absolutely. You. See you then. Thank All you. Right. Well, Thank personally, you. we think the Ewings will be back and its loyal fan base will definitely be watching. I know we will well, right? We'll be watching. <laughs> so stay right there. You don't want to miss the cheese, man.